Mm-hmm. Once again, Pastor Bob Reynolds here from True Life Community, Seventh-day Adventist Church. I want to begin today by reading a, a, a verse from 2 Timothy chapter 1, verse 7. It says, For God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and a sound mind. <laughs> the people one Saturday night at 11 o'clock were getting ready to shut off the lights. And all of a sudden the lights went off by themselves. <laughs> power was shut off. The air conditioner shut off. The whole community lost power in their houses. Everybody wondered why, because there was no storm in the area that would have, uh, you know, lightning would have struck anything. And so they were wondering and they became kind of impatient because it was in July and it was hot and they needed their air conditioners to come on. Well, the power was out in that community all night long. They became impatient. And so they didn't find out what happened until the next morning. Well, it was, it so happened that a snake had gotten into the powerhouse and short-circuited everything and fouled everything up. (laughs) So all night long, it was because a snake had gotten into the powerhouse. You know, we as Christians, we are the power of God on earth. He created us to be a power to teach people the story of the Bible, to teach people about Jesus and his love and his sacrifice for us. But you know, sometimes the snake gets into the powerhouse, short circuits us. I mean, a Christian life, uh, we can pick up bad habits, we can pick up addictions, we can say things and say th- uh, think things that are evil, and it kind of short circuits our power. The devil makes sure that, you know, he's the author of all sin. Everything that happens that's, that goes wrong in our lives is created by the devil. It's the way he has of short-circuiting the power that God created us to be. So, let me read again. For God has not given us the spirit of fear, but of power and of love and a sound mind. Let's pray that today we will open our word, the word that God has given us, spend time with him in prayer, so that that power will not be short-circuited, okay? Father, we are, as Christians, your powerhouse on this, on this earth. We are those who are supposed to go out there and sow, and, and sow good seeds amongst people and show them that you are the mighty God that saves us, that, that has gotten rid of, of Satan, the snake that wants to short-circuit us. You have overcome him. We just have to accept you so that we can overcome him too. In Jesus' name, amen.